Guys, for any cheat points, anything like that, FIFA coins, any games, anything you need, really, go and check out MuleFactory.com. You see the link here, guys? It is down below in the description. Use Owen FIFA at checkout. As you can see, they sell loads of different coins, ranging from like 2K if you need a few little coins just to start trading, maybe. Or there are big amounts, like you go down here, like you see, 150K or whatever. They are cheap prices, guys. Obviously, right now, prices are quite high due to FIFA just coming out. But make sure you check them out, guys, in the description and use Owen FIFA for a discount. Hey guys, what are going to do today and welcome back to my actual first video on the console of FIFA 20. Um, so I've got a PS4 now as you can see, I did say I'd go and buy one soon and I went to buy one yesterday. I didn't really upload anything yesterday or the day before, I was just getting sorted with everything. So it should be Saturday, it should be two uploads today guys, Saturday around lunchtime and then again on Saturday afternoon. I'm going to show you how to trade at the start of the games with 10k coins. So I've gone out and done a little bit of trading. These are just converter players that I've got a few deals on. 1.1k, I wish people building starter teams might use someone like Gabriel. This session you're on again 850 converted and same with Tello, but it's not something you want to be doing all the time. You want to be doing different methods. So I'm going to show you guys a few good little methods to get started with on the game. So the first one is going to be BPL centre back method. We're just going to look here now at 600 coins. You'll see there's loads of centre backs here, but if you go to like Anchor and different cam styles, like you can go BPL. If you look at Anchor BPL, it's about like 1k is the standard price. But obviously, if you look through for decent ones, obviously you can get deals on, or you can just go Anchor centre back and then go anywhere and just go to like 800, 850. There's nothing up at all. You'll see there. So 950 is the cheapest. So you can actually try and snipe things like this at the um, deal. Obviously, you can put Defender in as well and just go down to that. I think it's eight, um, it might be a little bit. It's still 950 actually, so they do change price quite a lot. I mean, you can probably get some deals, obviously. Maybe Shadow is probably the better one to do it on. Like, so here you can see. So if you go to Shadow and you go 2k, you'll see there's nothing up. Um, you have to get towards like nearly 3k before there's some deals. Obviously, if you keep searching, you can get some really good snipes on these. Hopefully, one will come up while we're searching. But, um,. It might not. So guys, um, there will be videos back now pretty much most days. Obviously, we're bashing them out. I'm going to get a stream going tomorrow as well over on Twitch, guys, which will be in the description. So go and check it out, guys. And obviously, I do have my coin sponsor again. I know people might say it's a bit hypocritical having a coin sponsor when you're a trader. But obviously, it's just people there if they want it. People are going to buy coins anyway, regardless. So if you do want some coins, guys, go and check out, out the description, obviously. But you can see here, like, Catalyst. I mean, you can get some decent deals. Nothing really up and about but on hunter you can see here the cheapest hunter card is 2.8k and that's any position obviously you want to go attacker because i mean you don't really want one of the random ones i mean you want to go and get a half decent hunter card and i mean we had a few deals last night actually um but you'll see 3233 3, 3 is the cheapest kind of price so once again you can snipe if you want to obviously you can drop it down to maybe like i don't know 2.5k and just try and snipe when it comes up and you see here 2k for far fight it's so hard to get them and i'm awful at sniping at the moment i obviously just got the console i'm not used to the control i mean look at the state of it so you're gonna have to bear with me when sniping i mean it's not how i used to be so you <laughs> i mean look at this i'm so slow I've not really optimised my sniping yet on the PS4, but obviously it's just getting used to it as time goes on. I'm not like, struggling to talk while doing it as well. I'm not like, so like struggling so much to do it, but um, we will get there. Obviously, I mean this is another good method, just sniping the hunter. But if you do find that difficult, go to 3K and just sit and press X and it's not even sorry square and circle <laughs> this is what i mean it's a crazy um different thing <laughs> i'm proper struggling with it but um you can do a few bits like this obviously and of course if you do have around 10k it's a decent method same with this one you can go like left forwards i mean if you look at left forward this year it's nowhere near as good as it used to be but i mean you can still see they are hitting like a K, so if you do get obviously Jota is an actual left forward this year, which is a little bit frustrating because it kind of like makes it more difficult to find other ones. But then with right forward, it's the same kind of story, really. There's a few that are right forwards, obviously, you can just get gold to get rid of all the shit ones that you don't want, and you'll see that there are um, none up, obviously, for a decent price. Like you look here, one three for the worst ones, the standard price. But um, yeah, so obviously once again you can snipe this sort of thing. Um, it's just about getting used to it really. Obviously on the 10 hour trial, it's a lot different to what it's going to be um, when the market's actually fully up and running. So this video is going to be basically how to make a lot of coins like this. 
I'm just making an early video and later on guys I'm going to try and do a video showing you how to make coins a different way. I'm going to just obviously investigate, I've only been on the game for about 30-40 minutes and I've already made quite a bit. I mean I only had like a K, I think I had to know 500 coins when I started so I'm up to about 13k when stuff sells now which is really really good. I am going to also aim for getting 10 minute videos out soon but while we're on this early point at the moment um, just about learning the market I mean you can obviously try different stuff yourself as well like silver BPL might be working at, not, at the moment it might not be it's also worth obviously looking for the SBC players that are good and just trying to snipe them you'll see there's a lot of goalkeepers maybe outfield players you might be able to play with just about getting used to what's good and what's bad there guys I'm going to leave it there obviously you will learn over time you see we've got a few things selling like I can say um, things aren't selling at lightning speed but things will sell. Um, but yeah, I hope you have enjoyed the video. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Drop a like and do feel free to sub if you are new as well. I uh, will see you all next time with a brand new.